Berlin, 2062. A dark megalopolis run by corporations and corrupt politicians. Nine-year-old orphan Tina has made the streets her home. She scavenges for a living, inventing new uses for scraps. Her only friend is SAM-53, the big clumsy robot assigned to her at birth. He will do anything to protect her. SAM-53 must protect Tina. Today, Tina and Sam will discover something that may change their world. Get a free robot. A forgotten dream a that will set them on an incredible journey. The journey to Good morning, Tina. Today's forecast is a high of 7 degrees Celsius and cloudy, with 0% chance of rain during the day and 73% chance of rain in the evening. Would you like to hear the news? Morning, Sam. I have printed out today's to-do list. Would you like to go over it? Yeah, yeah, sure. For today, we need to procure the following. Oil for Sam 53, a new pair of socks and food for you and a waterproof patch for our shelter. All right then, let's get going. A bunch of useful things I've collected. A bunch of useful... We are getting electricity from that neon sign. Sam? Yes, Tina? I'm nine years old, like you. You should know that. It's 2062, and the 53 after my name is the year when I was produced. I was assigned to you at birth as a part of a government incentive program, too. Okay, okay, I know. I remember your lullabies. I just wanted to be sure. It's very, very tall. Sam? Yes, Tina? I'm stuck. I don't know what to do anymore. Would you like a hint? But please try not to ask for too many. Calculating the odds of each hint stresses my CPU, and I must count each hint, even the repeated ones to avoid overheating. Yes, Sam, I know. But please, I need help to go on. Okay, what would you like to know? the flight bus ticket we got last night. I think you should look inside every hole around our shelter, but be careful. Sometimes hideous creatures hide there. It may be safer to create a trap to capture them first. For example, by combining some bait with a container. Um, okay, thanks.
a water tank for firefighters. My fingers are too big to fit in there. Getting electricity from that neon sign. Better if it stays where it is. Tina? Yes, Sam? Are you feeling all right? I'm good. Thanks for asking. this way. Uh, yes? Am I safe talking to someone so sketchy who lurks in the shadows? Uh, do I look sketchy? I'm actually a very sweet guy. When I'm not teaching or hiding in the shadows, I spend my time cuddling Polino. Who's Polino? A cute Robert pet I made. I painted him like Gene Simmons. Like who? Oh, never mind. All right, all right. I think I can trust you. Sure thing. Anything else? Who are you? And what are you doing here? I'm Eku, but don't tell my name to the police. At night, I'm a professor at the University of Neo Berlin. But since the salary is very low, during the day, I... Oh, well, I'm a dealer. An unauthorized cyber dealer. What are you selling? Odds and ends, implants, gadgets, electronic components, and so on. Any food, robot oil, socks, a waterproof patch? Nope, sorry, nothing like that. Damn! What do you teach? I'm a robotics professor. I teach design and fabrication of flexible-use small-scale bots. Sounds nice. Why are they paying you so little at the university? Because Mr. Rumpf, the mayor of the city, doesn't care about education. That corrupt bastard. I hope he won't be re-elected. Me too. Sounds cool, but I should go now. Alright, take care. Rotten sushi and a 
broken floppy in here. Nothing disgusting left to pick up anymore. to leave this place. I found one last night, and I was sure I left it by my pillow. But it's not there anymore. It must be somewhere nearby. Better look for it. I need a fly bus. I found one last... It must be some... I'm already here! in there to crawl on my hand. My fingers are too big to fit in there. Yes, Tina? I'm stuck. Would you like a hint? But please, calculating the odds of me, and I must count. Yes, Sam, I... Okay. Yes, Sam, I... Okay. What would you like to know? Where's the flight bus ticket we got last night? I think you should look inside every hole around our shelter. But be careful. Sometimes hideous creatures hide there. It may be safer to create a trap to capture them first. For example, by combining some bait with a container. Um... Let's see if it works. Nice!
we're cyberspace junkie. They trip in a miserable world similar to Neil Berlin, just with more flashing lights. An electrician with a pair of keys hanging from his pocket. It's too far. I cannot steal from public workers. Hello? Yes. What are you doing over there? I'm enjoying the view of the Brandenburg Gate. I never understood why it's so big. Were there giants in ancient times? Yeah, everybody was six meters tall. Now leave me alone. I'm busy. Seriously? What are you doing besides making fun of me? I'm Blixie, a city electrician, fixing the screens of this street light, so they can show Mr. Rump propaganda. Ugh. I hope they pay you well. Not really. I can't go. I thought that city maintenance was a task for robot workers. It usually is, but not if it involves electricity. Robots can go totally nuts if they get electrocuted. So it's better to rely on humans for these kinds of jobs. I see. Nothing. I should go. Bye. It doesn't work. Nothing left there. Please select your meal. Press confirm to pay with the overlit credits. I don't have any credit. Nothing left there. Tonight, Maisie's stunning performance. It's some sort of stage. I wonder how it works. It's some sort of st- This wire is going into the water, electrifying the puddle. We can't walk over there. That puddle is a... We can't walk... I can directly choose the two items I want to put together. I can directly choose. I can direct. Wrong choice. Nah. Nope. 
working. Not working. It's not working. This automatic door is broken. It won't open. 